Hey everyone, I'm Zagasti, and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. Forgot the name of the game there for a second, don't know why. Uh, anyways, as you can probably tell, the, the surroundings of where I left off last time are a bit different. Duplicates are a bit different. It's all a bit different. It's because I switched from the one that I was on for... Stadium, I think it was called. I don't remember uh, exactly, but I switched from that one to Oceana, which you know, much has been so far much, 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 much easier for me to uh, build everything on. I've also changed the way I build. I'm building three things down, you know, for real nice oxygen and carbon dioxide just flow through the base. Nice, breathable base. And I also made my beds like this, just for optimal optimal size and showing of I don't know, space? I, I don't question that one. I don't really know either. Um, but now I have a colony summary. So these are the sta- oh. It's not raw. So with that I got some omelets in a, in a thing from the the printing pod and I got to just the it's not raw achievement it's great so in here you can go and like you can see all the achievements your current colony has done so as you can see I've gotten the red light green light not sure how I got that one I never did it I, I haven't done anything with automation yet it just popped up um, I got the it's not raw and to pay the bills, use the duplicate skill points to buy out an entire branch of the skill tree. Which is really easy when you've got a tidying duplicate, because it's only two. It's weird. This. <laughs> oh, uh, okay, so is this just counting everything in the world? Uh, that's interesting. I wish I'd kind of only count my stuff, not everything in the world. But, you know what, whatever. Doesn't matter. But yeah, over here you can see oxygen production, consumption of said oxygen, calorie... Production, consumption, uh, production, consumption, amount of duplicates, travel time, work time, travel time, work time, rockets, domestic creators, average stress, average stress, removed and created, uh, and creators, wild and domesticated. You, you can see a whole bunch of things. And there's also, when you go on here, there's also like little objectives for you to get. Survive 200 cycles, maintain 16 morale, print 12 duplicates, and build a great monument. And also breach the temporal tear. Ooh, sounds interesting, doesn't it? Alright, but now I can pick a duplicate, but right now I'm not in the mood to pick a duplicate. Yeah, especially these ones, they're kind of crappy. So I'll go with the baby shine bug. Shine nymph. Right. <laughs> yeah, so right now, I'm on the, uh. I'm on the end. I'm, I'm, I'm on the end game of, uh, surviving starvation. Borderline starvation of every single one of my colonists, uh, the duplicates. I gotta start saying duplicates to uh, colonists because I say colonists for colony survival, and this is actually not included, so it's duplicates. But yeah, I was, I had borderline, uh, killed them all by starvation because I had forgot to, uh, make a food source by accident. You know, I didn't get my meal, yeah, starvation, there we go. Yeah, see, there was starvation there for a quick second. Oh boy. But yeah, I managed to get, um, these ones started, and then as I was digging everything out to find some muck root to tide me over, I found more, uh, mealwood seeds, and I've started a little farm, which is good. I need farms. I also got two bathrooms, you know, right here and right here, so that they can all unreachable food starvation. Yeah. Gosman, why are you starving? Gosman. Gosman, come on. I, Gasman, you you can get food. We don't have any food. Oh Jesus! Oh Jesus! I, yeah, like I said, I'm coming off of it. Didn't say I was through with it yet. <laughs> oh, they might very well die. Okay, yeah. So, okay, how do we want to do this? I don't want to let that water out yet. So, I'm gonna break my law right now of not doing that. And, uh, do that. Also, sorry if it sounds like I'm a little nasally or stuffy. Um, it's because, I don't know, for some reason last night, 
I decided to get a nosebleed like none before. And it was literally bleeding all over the place from my nostril. And once I got, I got, I managed to get a tissue in one of them. Then the other one started leaking, or started bleeding. And I think, I don't know if it was because it was his own separate nosebleed, or if it was because, uh, morale four, morale needs three. Uh, I'll wait to get you that, buddy. It was because, um... I don't know, either it started its own nosebleed, or it kind of like funneled from one end of my nose into the next because of the, you know, um, sinuses. I, I'm not sure which, but god, it was a bad one. Like, it would not, it would not go down. It would not stop for a while. Normally they stop pretty quickly, but I don't know what it was about this one. It was just strange, strange nosebleed. Um... So dig, oh wait, no, I'm on cancel. Dang it. So I'm gonna dig this out. Dig that. Yeah, this should work, hopefully. So long as that doesn't break because of pressure, which I don't think it will. There's not very much water in this, in that area. So we should be good. Dig that all out. I j I'm literally just looking for muckroot. Oh wait, they're not starving anymore. All right, so we can slow this. I don't have to put that on nine. Okay, now I know someone's starving again. That is great. I was about to say, I don't have to put it on level 9 priority, but maybe I do. Maybe I was wrong. Who knows? All I know is that I'm going to get that done, because there's two, for sure, muckroots right there. And I need the food. I need the food, I need it now. So just dig me open that, cancel that, because that would require a specific, uh, my specific train digger. Where is he? Ah, oh, yeah, there you are, Ren. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Doing good? That's great. Camille here is my artiste. Uh, Eri is my farmer. She is the only one who does farming operations. Uh, Hassan is my researcher. So I have very good things. And Gasman over here is my tidy man. Tidy woman? Tidy man? What, what is it? I don't know. Uh, but any yeah, anyways, things are going good for now. I have plenty of, uh, I have plenty of algae. I have quite literally plenty of algae to spare right now. And there's a chlorine gas vent, which is good. It's close to the base, which is, is great, is good. I can get chlorine from that real easily. The only thing I'm worried about is chlorine getting into my base from bleachstone. That's the only thing. kind of wish bleachstone didn't. Um, excrete chlorine. Otherwise, it'd be much, much easier for me to, you know, tunnel through this area to get to the sand, which I need. But you know what? It, it's just the way it is. I can probably, I can make an airlock. You know, I, I can make an airlock for this. It wouldn't be too much of a problem. It's just that I don't want to because it's a waste of resources and time, and I don't have that. Starvation, you, could you guys stop starving for 10 seconds? I'm getting you food. I mean, come on, people, I'm trying. I'm trying here. Can't you see that? You, your, your king leader here, this is a democracy. Your leader here is trying very hard to keep you all alive. The least you could do is not starve to death. Get yourself some food. I really need to make a, I really need to make a food area. So, I have, yeah, these are going to be, right now the four barracks, but once I can get, uh, once I can get comfy beds, they're going to be turned into bedrooms, which is going to be a bigger morale bo bonus to my duplicates, which would be nice. More morale means they can handle more stressful jobs and everything else. I need to make a mess hall, or a great hall. How do I do that? Mess table, no industrial machinery. Oh, and a recreation building. Wow, what... What horrifyingly horrible things will I have to do to get a recreational building? Oh god, what will I ever do to find one of those? <laughs> it's literally one of the first things I learned. It's literally one of the first things I learned! Actually, I should put one here because I haven't put one down yet. Silly Zach. Silly, silly Zach. I also have some polluted oxygen flowing around through here, but that's, that's just from the algae terrariums. 
not too big of a deal, even if the duplicates breathe it in, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Also from this, yeah, that this is providing a lot more uh, than I would like it to. So you know what? I have... Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Put a mesh tower right there. Give me some plumbing, give me a bottler. Put a mesh tower right here. Yeah, there we go. Now for oxygen, get me a deodorizer. Put it right there. That should solve, hopefully, the uh, polluted oxygen being emitted from this place. I, I'm hoping. I also have some compost here to make some fertilizer from all of my uh, poopy business in the toiletries. What? Oh, more starvation. That's fantastic. Yo, I was hoping that this wouldn't be another colony survival video, but, uh, you know, me and starvation, they go hand in hand, don't they? That's always my biggest problem in this, well, not this game, but in most survival games that I play, it's starvation because I forget to give my people food. Yeah. Yeah, I do. I forget to give them food. Am I all out of food now? Oh, okay. So, dig that out. Party. Level 9 this, since it's more than one. You know, starving to death. Oh wait, no, that one of them got food. That's good. Yay, one got food. Good. Good, now they might not die. If you ever need to go and see how many calories your duplicates have for the day, or have left for the day, you can go and read your vitals. Oh shit. Oh wait, no, that's, to, that's for today. Oh god, I was about to... I was about to panic there. Okay, so... Camille needs it. Oh, that's not good that they're going into sleep mode right now. Oh, boy. This might be cutting it close then. That's gonna be great. Oh, sorry about that. It's still, though, stuffy nose. Don't know why. Probably the nosebleed. I also need to get more, uh, uh, power production up. And while I was in the, uh, Redante thing, I did make for power a, uh, wood burner. But the problem was, I made it in uh, an ice biome, you know, just to compensate for the heat. And I think it was because of the way that I built built it, you know, with the S-shape S -shape building down. That the, or the amount of space that I gave it, the little amount of space that I gave it, the carbon dioxide produced from it managed to build up so much in one area that it popped the duplicate's eardrums. It just made stress go so high. It's one of the reasons why I kind of quit that one. Just because with everything else going wrong, I didn't need that. You know, my foolishness of uh, oxygen generation, you know, uh, not doing that right. I, I accidentally took out all the oxy ferns because I didn't think it would be that big of a deal to, um, you know, harvest, have them domestically. I thought you could just put them in a pot, you know, like one of these little pots right here. I was wrong. You have to put them in a farm plot and they require dirt and water every day to function. Which, you know, not bad, but also kind of sucks for me. At least a little bit. Because, uh, that wasn't the smartest idea for me to take all of them out and figure that out later. Should have done that sooner. So, little tips you can all learn from watching me play and fail this game. Little, little tips. Ooh, another mealwood seed. Gimme, gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Or gimme, 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 yeah. <laughs> uh, anybody else like that song? Life is a highway? Are you going my way? Cause I wanna drive it all night long. Uh, those are the lyrics. No questions asked. I don't know, I like that song. Heard it the first time, I think, from, uh... Cars? I think it was the first time I heard it, I don't know, I don't remember. But I love the song. I used to love it when I was a kid. I'm like, oh, I heard this on the radio! Oh, I did, you great dog! It, it, yay! This small child deck is very easily pleased. <laughs> it's just... Oh. Uh, it was just good. Good song. I like it. I like the song. Very, very good beat to it. It's not, it's not like the, uh, a rhythm, I guess. Rhythm to it. It's, it's not like that stupid, uh, 
Oh god. What's the one song called? It's completely idiotic. I hate it. I hate it so much. I hate it to a core. Um. It's, uh, fucking. It goes like, white men be great, so they gotta be great, or some stupid crap like that. I mean. My god. The song just sucks. It's like, the rhythm does not go good with the singer's voice, and it does not go good with the beat, and the lyrics does not go with it. It just sounds awful to me. And if you like the song, that's, you know, fine if you like the song. I do not. I hate it with a passion. If I hear that... If I hear it, I will immediately switch to something else. Like, a point five second... Point five seconds after hearing that stupid beat, I will s immediately switch to something... A different song, a different, uh... A different, um... Radio channel, I, I don't care. Switch to a different one. Whatever it may be that I'm watching. I just hate it so much. It, it is an abomination. It should not be considered a good song. In any sense of the word. <sighs> but if you like it, you know what? That's your business. Couldn't care less if you like that trash. As I'm constantly shitting on the song. I'm not sorry for shitting on it. I think it's horrible. I don't care who I who the who hears that. I it's a horrible song. I talk to my friends. They agree with me. It, they they think it's a horrible song too. Just because it it just doesn't sound good. It sounds awful. Not not the lyrics, but just it just sounds awful in almost every sense of the word to you, my ears. You know, Harry, how the... How? Okay, you all saw that. You all saw Harry jump up from here to there. You all saw that. <laughs> Harry, why? why? Why, Harry? Why would you do this to yourself? Why would you do this to yourself and make me have to dig you out? Come on now. Harry, be, be reasonable, here. reasonable here, Harry. Uh, these duplicates, they're not the smartest. They're not the smartest duplicates, but, uh... They do get the job done, I guess. They, they do get the job done. Which is good. That's their only redeeming quality. Is that they get the job done. Um... Masterwork? Yeah, I kinda do want that masterwork. Not gonna lie. Um... Oh, this is that. This will actually work, then. What about this one? No, that one's still overriding it. This... Okay, so yeah, that one will actually make it good. Alright, actually, let me go into the duplicate skills. Let me get them their new hats and everything else. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Look at that pretty hat there. Look at that amazing hat. It's got a thing in it. Is that a chisel? I think it's a chisel. But yeah, that, that hat looks cool. All the new hats. I love them. I love the new hats. I love Gosman's hat. I love Hassan's hat. I love every hat in this game. Gives them just that bit more of a personality that I enjoy. Because I, I do enjoy personality with my characters. Gosman's starving. That's great. That's fantastic. Come on, Gosman. Get some food. Get some food, Gosman. Please. For the love of God, Camille. Camille, you need the food. You need it now. It's your cash money and you need it now. Have I made that joke before? I think I've made that joke before. I don't know. I don't remember, nor do I care to remember. I could, oh, right, I forgot to set this, didn't I? Okay, polluted oxygen, or polluted water, level 9. Okay, so go get that water, duplicates, please. Oh, good, that's not going to happen until tomorrow, then. Cool! That's great! That's fantastic! Hmm, love it. Love it so much. Yeah, as you can see, I'm not short on water. Polluted... Uh, that's regular. There are guys are over here. Normally, water and regular water in one of these, you know, slime biomes can really mean water, but it's gonna be tricky to get to. 
Because of all the slime lung. I hate slime lung. I have to make a decontamination vent, won't I? Oh, good. Oh, good. I love decontamination vents. They're so fun. If only I had... Oh, God. If only I could find some buddy buds, it'd be so much easier. I just make make a little section here and put a door and put a door and put a buddy briar in and it'd be good. We'd be good. We'd be grand. Nothing bad would happen. But uh, that's not how this works, unfortunately. Slime lungs have always been my bane that I don't know how to deal with. And more starvation. That's great. It's been my bane that I don't know how to deal with and has prevented me from going into um, these biomes for a long time if I don't have a better way through, which I, I really don't other than digging into the polluted water and going up. Hmm. That would quite literally be my only option. I'd have to dig through here. Yes, yeah, starvation, whatever. And dig up right into that area to s just to see if there's a... If there's a water geyser in there. I hope there is, because if there's a water geyser and a chlorine geyser right by my base, that's gonna be nice. That's gonna be really, really good. Also, I do have the, uh, the little thing, it's, uh, what is it? Sub, subterranean ocean or whatever it is. It's got, it makes it so that there's a crap ton of water in, uh, in the game, and with Oceana being as the world that I chose, I think that's a pretty good, uh, thing to have. A subsurface uh, ocean, if you don't mind me saying. But yeah, subsurface ocean means I got a lot of salt water. I already have the distillation, yeah, dis desalinator, yeah, desalinator, which will take the salt out of the water and you know just turn into regular water, which I can use uh, most likely at a at a lesser rate. Like I'll get less water than I put in it, but. It'll, if, if I'm in a pinch, it'll still give me clean water. Why are you guys starving? Come on. I have food. Food is good. Food is num nums. We have it. We have food. <laughs> Come on, guys. Don't do this to me now. Don't do this to me now after all we've suffered through. Come on. I need you now. Don't let me down. Say something. I'm giving up on you. Or else. I'm giving up on you. Right. Oh boy. Oh, oof. I'm past my minutes. Okay. This. Is... Oh, I'm already past my minutes, aren't I? Alright, so I'm going to be having to end this video here. If you liked what you saw, the uh, borderline mess that is my uh, colony on uh, actually not included, then, you know, maybe hit that subscribe button, notification bell so you can see when I post. And don't forget to leave a like and comment too about what games I can play in the future, as well as what I can do to improve the games I'm already playing, because I really appreciate it. It helps immensely with what I still have to figure out. Editing and recording wise, my favorite videos make my videos better in general for you to watch and experience. Also, in the comments, um, <clears throat> if you've got any tips or tricks for me to, you know, help me along in here, please, please give them to me. <laughs> I very much welcome some hints and tips for this game. Also, in the comments, uh, could you tell me if I'm, like, uh, moving fast? through the stages of this game, like the beginning stages, because I'm not sure if I'm going too slow or too fast or just at the right pace. I'm not entirely sure. But anyways, that's all I gotta say for now. So, until the next video, goodbye everyone.